Yinka. Yes, day G. Yinka. Yes, day G. What's hey, up? Hey, mom, do you want to give me some dating advice? Dating advice? Yeah, come on, give me some, give me some dating advice. First of all, yeah. When you, what do you mean? In what? Just, what give, just, give, just give me any sort of dating advice, mom. Um, I'm 27. I know. I've kind of like lived a little bit, but give me, give me. I, I'm still single, so give me like some dating advice. Don't date a girl that sleeps around. Okay. Um, I mean. That, that, yeah, that, sh that should be obvious, but yeah, I get you. Yeah, but sometimes you, you, you sometimes you won't know no, no. when you start introducing her to your friends. All right, so so, say, oh. so, do so don't date a promiscuous woman. A promiscuous woman, yes. Okay, all right, yeah. all right, go on. Date a godly woman. A godly woman, all But right. not religious, too religious. Not, not too religious. Not too so religious. Not, so not... So someone who's religious but not like culty. Culty, that's yeah, it. Yeah, no one, okay. Yeah, but all right. she's kind of got the fear of God in her. Yeah. So someone like that, yeah. she will dress decently. Yeah. She won't Oh so like you don't I shouldn't go for uh, okay, I say like a girl who shows like her boobs. Oh her boobs. Like, like cleavage. Cleavage. Oh, all to, of that on to, Instagram and all of that. Should, to, I, should, to, I, should I date a girl like that? No, because, you know, you see, my body is the Lord's temple. Okay, don't, so don't mess see, with me, right? Yeah, don't mess with me. Go, so, well, God's property. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, you see, what I'm trying to say is that when you date a decent girl, mm. you won't, I mean, like, everything is meant to be private. Mm. You know, when you're having your thing together, you shut the door, mm. it's private. But when you date a girl that you're seeing all the oranges showing, when she bends down, people are seeing her panties. Mm. It, it makes her look cheap. It makes her look cheap, okay. It makes her look cheap. Okay. Can you imagine your daddy and I dating? Mm. Say for instance, we're da dating and he asks me to go out with him. And then I wear something very short. Mm. Your daddy will say, you can come here. Mm. You're not going out like that with me, are you? Mm. I say, yes, of course. He said, no, you're not. Mm. Because it will make me look cheap. Mm. Do you see what I mean? Or I wear something that would be too revealing. So when you're in front of your friends, maybe she might be a pretty girl and everything, but because she's wearing she's wearing something that's too revealing, so they won't know where to look. They'll be looking like this. Oh, what's that? And then having said that, the reason why I'm saying all this is that God forbid. Say for instance, I'm driving and I didn't wear any bra. Mm. I didn't wear any panties. Mm. And I happen to get myself involved in a car accident. God forbid. God forbid. Mm -hmm. No panties, mm. no bra. Mm. And they say, oh, is that not case size, mom? Thank you, mom. And then everybody, you know, everybody's got smartphones. But you know, if I have pants on, people will understand. And you say, no pictures. So people can easily put a cloth over. But someone who is already, no panties, no bra on. You see? So these accidents could happen, or God forbid, you're wearing a dress and all of it, uh, of a sudden, or your skirt, it coats and it tears. If you've got pants on, you'll be fine. People mm. know that an accident happened. Mm. But can you imagine? No panties, mm. no bra on, mm. anything could happen. There was a program I watched on TV mm. and the lady, she bent down like this and the skirt was very tight and it ripped. Mm. You know, mm. so you you see, you have to be very careful. So don't, that, that's I, I mean, I'm not pointing the finger at any girl or woman, but in my opinion, I think women should dress decently. Or oh, what do you think, guys? No, no, do I, you I, agree I, with me? I agree. Give me more dating advice. Okay, more so, dating so, advice. So far, so don't date a girl who's out there who's mm -hmm. a, who's a, who's a slut. Mm -hmm. Don't date someone who doesn't respect themselves. Mm -hmm. Okay, a girl that talks trashy you know when she talks it's like she's always cursing swearing mm. it will it's kind of embarrassing so when you take you know it's like say you want to introduce her to your friend you say oh i've just met this girl she's she's cool she's so sweet she's pretty she's all that mm. and you know they say oh, not all that glitters is gold so then you introduce her to your friend and the first thing that comes out of her mouth and you know swearing cursing and you think you yeah. do better than that. It's embarrassing, you know. Mm. You wouldn't like that kind of a person, would yeah, you? No, 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 you're you right. see what I mean? All right. And also, sometimes, I mean, sometimes you see some pretty girls. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying, I mean, some girls are pretty and they're reserved. Mm. And there's some that in between, they're not that pretty and they're not ugly. 
mm. the in between mm. the some the, the, also, mid, the mid the, the mid the, yeah some of them so are what the mid what do you mean by mid the mid say the mid the mid yeah so like they're not ugly they're not hot they're, they're not mid. ugly they're not hot so the mid yeah okay say whatever it. the mid is that it <laughs> yeah. i don't know no, no, say the is midi. that the term? Say, say the midi the midi yeah. okay <laughs> the midi <laughs> hello tank hey tank go hello. away hello, Bro, hello darling hey, hello, why is it so wet he wants it, oh, oh, oh yes, he is wet. So wet man. I know he's just drank some water. Say it, say it, say it, say, it, say the, the meaty youths. Say it, meaty youths. What does meaty youths mean? <laughs> you did it. Thank you. The meat, uh, anyway, carry on, yeah. So they're not hot in the, uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. The meaty. And then, the mid, the mid. Now also, don't date a very lazy girl. Don't date a lazy girl. No. Okay. Someone that's hardworking. Yeah. That will put the house in order. You know, you can tell that even when you're not at home. You know, yeah. oh, I can trust uh, my wife. She's gonna look after the children. Yeah. She's gonna cook. She's gonna clean the house. But when you marry or uh, date a lazy girl, then mm. you know her panties all over the floor. Mm. Her clothes all over the floor. Mm. the bed has not been made mm. the pots and plates are in the sink mm. you know it will kind of put you off do you mm. see what i mean yeah you know so you don't want that kind of a girl mm. because you might be lazy you don't want to date somebody else who's lazy yeah because nothing will get done absolutely totally yeah. nice exactly yeah all right now let me hit you with a scenario okay a scenario, hit, hit you yeah. scenario. I, i'm walking in okay so mm-hmm. i i've just come i've just come home from work or whatever mm-hmm. i'm walking in i mean i work from home let's say I, okay i'll go out to see the boys all right mm-hmm. go out to see the boys play golf mm-hmm. or paddle you know mm-hmm. um and then I come home and then she's there in bed with another man. What do I do? Do I break both their faces? What, what do I do? That's an assault, isn't it? Yeah, but tell me, what do I do? Just get rid of her ASAP. Just get rid of her? Yeah, that's the end or, of the relationship. Or, or actually open the door for foul play. So then do I just leave the room and be like, oh, okay, you know what? That's fine. You, oh, okay, so I guess that's what we're doing now. So then I'll go, I'll leave. Come back with my own girl. No, two wrongs don't make a right, isn't it? But two rights make a left. Yeah, but having said that, you still... I mean, you just know at the bottom of your heart that that relationship... All right, all right, all right Dad, come, come through. Come through. Dad, hit me with uh, some dating advice. Anything. What that comes to your head? Just go for it. You same girl. What, no, no. Okay, no, no. That's, come on. Give me, hit me with like some proper deep... I'm a, I'm a virgin, Dad. Yeah. I'm a virgin. I've I've never I've never seen a vagina. Hit me with some good advice. Then, in that sense, or just date and only, huh? Only, only fine. What do you mean, date and only fine? <laughs> yeah. So you'll get yeah, you will be able to get experience. <laughs> Are you crazy? What do you mean only fine? I mean, fans? say why the girl. So date only fans, then you. If that's a promiscuous friends. girl, isn't it? No, no, no. It's like. Oh, only no, fans what, is only, what is only fans? No, it's no. Like YouTube, what is it? only fans? They show the. They show. Oh, they, they do show. They only show stuff. They, they show their the breasts. Uh huh. That to the world. Yeah. They show the. The, the below. To they the only world. show to the. They only show. To the world. So that the whole world has seen, and you want to. And you want to date someone like that? <laughs> Good so, luck. So, so that, so your advice is date, date only fans. Only fans, yeah. All right. Okay. So, Jesus. all right. So, date, so your advice is good. So, so uh, any any other advice there? Um, just you, you date one girl. Hmm? You date several. De- okay. So, so you can have a lot of experience. Okay. All right. Okay. Now, have you thought about disease? <laughs> you have to no. You have Con- to- Condom doesn't mean you walk, you can't catch catch disease. Here's Are you not gonna kiss her? Don't buy African condom. Are you not going to kiss her? <laughs> By kissing her, you can catch them. You know, you know, you do. You do, you do have you heard of soul tide? Yeah. Yeah. When you start sleeping with so many girls, yeah. the soul tide, whatever any garbage that girls got, you will you will take that garbage upon yourself. And you be in garbage like that. Okay. All right, mm-hmm. carry on then. Start sleeping around. It's not sleeping around, it's experience. Uh, it's experience. You get me experience. That is stupid. Is it? Yes, it is a stupid advice. And you're, and you're going to let the whole world hear about it. Are they recording it? Oh. He's recording it. Uh huh. Go, go out with a Christian girl. No. <laughs>
I, well, God, I hope you enjoyed. You I'm, can I'm, go out with a God-fearing girl. Yeah, no, said, yeah, yeah. You know, the fear of God is the yeah. beginning of wisdom. Yeah, no, but honestly, don't go out yeah. with someone that's into the religion. Yeah, yeah, I, you know? yeah, yeah, no, I get you. Uh -huh. I get you. Thank uh -huh. you, thank you, thank you for, uh, thank you for this advice. You're I needed, welcome. I needed this. You will. I'm new to the game, so okay. thank you. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed. Maybe that might be helpful for you. Awesome. In a bit.